Hey y'all, it's Cassie. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make two quick and easy Easter DIYs using Dollar Tree supplies in under five minutes. The first thing I'm using is a wire form that I got, actually it's not wire, it's plastic, that I got from the Dollar Tree that was in the shape of a bunny head that was wrapped in tinsel. I just took all the tinsel off, put a little hot glue at the bottom, and just started wrapping this sucker with jute cord. I mean, I wrapped the crap out of it. And you just wanna add some hot glue every now and then to make sure that it sticks. I actually got this bundle of jute cord from my local Goodwill. Um, they had a huge big bin of it and I just bought them out. Now when you get to where the ears start, you want to cut that um, and then do each ear separately. It just makes it a lot easier. And again, add the heck out of some hot glue. I was going for a very, very, very rustic look so mine isn't completely covered and in some spots you can still see some of the plastic and that's okay. I mean, if you want to add more, totally go for it but I didn't mind and you know it looks very natural. <laughs> I wanted mine to be able to stand up so I'd actually had some of these little wooden round discs that I had gotten from Amazon so not Dollar Tree and I added some more hot glue to the bottom of the bunny and stuck it on one of the little discs and I realized it wasn't going to stay up as good as I wanted so I ended up hot gluing another one to the back. I also wanted to add just a little bit of color, so I took some lace ribbon that I had gotten from Hobby Lobby last year, and at first I was going to put a bow around the center around the neck, and then I decided I didn't want to do that. I wanted it a little bit more rustic, so I ended up just wrapping around one of the ears into a double knot. Not even a bow, just a double knot, and I think it turned out pretty cute. I would recommend putting the bow on before you attach it to your wooden disc, though. So for this one, I'm using three of the Dollar Tree headbands. I just pulled the uh, little bunnies off of there. Um, and then I'm using three more of those little wooden discs that I got from Amazon and three bamboo skewers. I honestly think I got those bamboo skewers from Kroger. So I just figured out how long I wanted these or how tall I wanted the bamboo skewers to be and I scored them using my razor and then just broke them in half. I knew I was gonna need some beads to get these to stand up, but I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to use. So I still have a bunch of those left over that I had gotten at Walmart. And I ended up going with three of the same color, but just different styles. Obviously the bunny is two-sided, but I actually wanted to use the side that had the little tail. Now I am cutting this um, tag off, but seriously, just rip it off. I don't know why I was trying to cut it. So to add the bamboo skewer, I just stuck it up in the little wire frame, put some hot glue at the bottom of the bamboo um, skewer and pushed it through the bead and then added some hot glue to the bottom of the bead and attached it to the center of the round wooden disc. It's as simple as that. There is a little hole um, on the, the round wooden disc. Personally, I didn't care about that because I'm gonna be putting it up on a shelf, so you're not really gonna be able to see it anyways. And then I just repeated the process two more times.
This is probably the easiest DIY I've ever done and they're super cute. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you might have done differently. And as always, stay curiouser.